Hi everybody and welcome into my channel. Thank you so much for tuning into today's video, which is going to be about the praying mantis and what it means when you see this insect inside of your life. I'm going to be talking about the symbolism behind this insect and the meaning behind this insect when you see it along your path or if you're even just seeing images of this insect. Any type of synchronicity or repeating encounters that you have with the praying mantis we're gonna get deep into what that means and what the message is for you when you sing Praying Mantis. So let's go ahead and figure out what we can learn from the Praying Mantis. Alright, so the praying mantis. This is a really interesting creature with a lot of history and so much information to unveil onto you guys. And let's do it. So when you see this animal inside of your life, this is a creature that you can see it once, you can see it twice, or you can even just see images of a praying mantis. You could be looking into the sky and you could see that the clouds are shaped like a praying mantis. It could be in any type of way, but either way, you know that the moments that you saw the image or the actual creature inside of your life, you felt like it was talking to you, or you felt like it had a message for you, something that felt or seemed really spiritual or very majestic, okay? So what does it mean when you actually see this creature? It's coming into your life to tell you that you're about to experience some challenges in life, okay? It can come into your life to tell you that it's about to be time for changes to happen, shifts to happen inside of your life. And when it comes to animal totems overall, you will see that a lot of animals do come into your life to give you messages right when there's going to be changes in your life. And the reason why is because as an individual, what ends up happening is when you're going through an experience where you're feeling changes in your life, or even right before you feel changes in your life, inside of you, you're actually seeking guidance. And inside of you, you're actually seeking some type of message or some type of, you know, clue in life. And that's why a lot of creatures, when you watch different videos or if you even do your research, you'll see a lot of animal totems. It comes down to saying, this means that change is gonna happen. But it is really true with the praying mantis change is going to happen inside of your life i've experienced this personally lots of different times you will see that you'll see the praying mantis and shortly after things will start to move extremely fast in your life when it comes to seeing the praying mantis you can see a lot of different changes whether it's jobs whether it's friends whether it's love either way you can even get some information that could be really hard to process but either way, you're going to be going through an experience that might be challenging. And the praying mantis is coming into your life to tell you that you need to actually be able to be powerful and strong to wait and be patient, but also really important to digest the information and move through the adversity that you're experiencing with grace, okay? Just like the praying mantis has the characteristics of standing still and then you'll see it swinging like this that's basically what it's asking you to do with the upcoming events inside of your life it's telling you to find a moment to be still it's telling you to know when exactly to act so it's about processing information it's about being able to take in the experience and it's even about being able to blend in with your experience and go with the flow when you sit there and observe the praying mantis, what you'll come to see is the praying mantis will come to you in your life and you might find a moment where it's actually just staring at you just like this. And it's staring at you for a long time and it's waiting for you to move before it moves, okay? Or sometimes it actually just jumps on you and karate kicks you. But either way, it's telling you to make sure that you are taking in the information, that you are moving strategically and that you are really able to sit still with the information. 
You may find yourself seeing a praying mantis that's green. You may find yourself seeing a praying mantis that's brown. It's the same type of species. It's just that the praying mantis has the ability to camouflage itself inside of nature as a defense mechanism. So this is coming into your life to tell you that when you're going through these challenging times, to really make sure that you're able to go with the flow and really be able to blend in with what is going on. Even though life may be chaotic, even though things may seem really, you know, challenging, make sure that you're not sticking out like a sore thumb. Make sure that you're able to blend in with your surroundings so that way you can be able to not be disturbed while you're going through this moment of taking in information and deciding when to act. So seeing this animal or this insect is also a message to tell you that it's not a time to take harsh decisions. It's not a time to be very impulsive. It's not saying that you can't make any decisions at all. It's just saying when it comes to making decisions, make sure that you thoroughly think things through. Make sure that you thoroughly process the information, process the individuals and the challenge, process what it is that you're experiencing, okay? The praying mantis is also coming into your life to tell you that it's time to trust your instincts because this creature is very instinctuous, if that is a word. This creature is very instinctuous. It's very capable of acting upon its instinct, okay? It's able to see light. It sees creatures, it sees other beings, and human beings as life. That's how its vision works. So it may be attracted to you because of your light. And that may be why you're actually seeing the praying mantis. And because of that, it's actually a really good symbolism. And it's a really great omen to have in your life. It means good luck. It means that you are gonna make it through what it is that you're going through, but you're gonna have to really trust your own intuition. And you're gonna have to really trust your own instinct and in knowing how to move, when to move, when to blend in, when to stand out, when to act, okay? Because going deeper into the symbolism for the praying mantis, you can look at how the praying mantis acts in nature when it's mating with its spouse or when it's mating with its partner that it's going to have babies with. Just like the black widow, the praying mantis actually eats its partner during conception, during that moment where the egg is being planted inside of them or the larva or whatever happens. During that moment, the praying mantis actually goes ahead and eats its partner okay so as peaceful as this praying mantis can look as gentle as it can look i know some of you out there have experienced it actually karate kicking you and really just jumping on you and kicking you because that has happened to me like five times and it even has the ability to go ahead and devour its partner so it's telling you to own your strength own your power own your life own your ability to fight through challenges in life. Own your ability to fight enemies and fight your opponents and also own your ability to fight through adversity. However, you are supposed to be really mature in the way that you go about that, you know, the way that you go about that situation. Don't just abuse your power, but instead, instead you're being told to be more like a peaceful warrior. That is what it means when you see a praying mantis. It's asking you to be a peaceful warrior. This creature has existed inside of Earth for a long time. Many different cultures have used this creature as a symbolism of all the things that I've just listed. It depends on your cultural background as well, and it depends on the information that you feel when you actually see the praying mantis. What's happening inside of your life when you see the praying mantis? What are the thoughts that you're having the moments before you see the praying mantis? And what are the feelings that you're having? That's going to be able to pinpoint exactly what this animal is trying to tell you is going to happen in your life or the message that it's trying to give to you, okay? So down to the Native Americans, that looked at this creature 
down to um, can the state of Connecticut using this creature as its insect, its state, its state insect, down to the Chinese that look at this, this insect as a spiritual creature of good luck, down to even Greek mythology and Greek um, history where they looked at the praying mantis as a praying mantis. That's where it got its name from, from something more religious. But besides all that, even inside of Africa, you have the bush people which looked at the praying mantis as themselves. They believed that the praying mantis was once a bush man as well. And if you know about your ancestry, or if you know about the ancestry of human beings overall, you'll know that the Bushmen are a very, very, very old, old tribe when it comes to human existence, okay? So, I really hope that this video is able to help you and give you information. I know that this will be beautiful tips and very helpful tips that can help you navigate through what it means when you see a praying mantis inside of your life. So guys, if you want to see more of my videos, make sure that you hit the like button on this and make sure that you also subscribe to my channel. For more information or if you want any of my healing services, my information is going to be inside the description box below where you can visit my website. And of course, make sure you check out my YouTube channel, check out my playlist Spirit Animals where you can see more animals and you can see what those animals mean. So guys, thank you so much and I'll see you all inside of the next video. Bye bye.